This is Earth Sketchpad, I'm your boy Musa, and in three minutes, this iguana can be yours. Join iguana, I like to start with the mouth. Nostrils, that short head, wide set eyes, the iguana hasn't got his mouth open. They do have a sharp set of teeth. Go to the feet. A sharp set of claws. This one has rose there. I'm coming down, I'm draw the tail. The tail actually helps them swim. Now we're gonna add in the scales. Do a couple M's for Musa. Make them nice and spiky, almost like the claws. And iguana in three minutes, just. So this amazing footage of this baby iguana running away from a load of snakes, but this iguana, he ain't running from nobody. Start off with a little snake underneath his sharp claws. He's gonna let him go, but he needs to be taught a lesson. Got a little tongue hanging out there. Crosses on the eyes, because he's passed out. Gonna add another one over here. Try and be loose with the shape. Adding some little pow lines. Now we're gonna move on to the tail. We're gonna add in a little, like a whoosh type of situation. These snakes have messed with the wrong iguana. One there, pow. Take that snake. Snakes flying everywhere. That's one busy snake. Some of these don't need to add a head, just add the tail <laughs> flying out. A little bit of extra. Up here, looking cool, looking cool. Filling these claws real quick. Give it that, give it that extra edge. And as we mentioned earlier, these claws are very good for rock climbing. So a nice solid rock here. The snake on top of it, all passed out. They are little smooth rocks, they represent like sand. Cool. Give it a little bit more depth. And I think that's it. 
an iguana taking a fight to the snakes. Pow! Want to see more Creature Chaos? Check out the BBC Earth Kids channel for more sketch pack picks.